it gone? Today we're going to go over how to draw a Squid Game uh, version of Spider-Man. Uh, it's going to be super easy, simple, and for beginners. It's only going to be an eight minute video, so stay all the way to the very end of the video um, because it's so short. Um, so the idea is that in eight minutes you will have a brand new skill uh, to add to your arsenal. Um, and that's it. Uh, like I said, this is for beginners. So if you like learning how to draw, if you like learning um, just kind of like how to draw your favorite characters, comics, uh, you know, movie series, anything like that, and cool ideas like I'm about to do, um, hit the subscribe and click the bell notification. That's going to let you know when I post. All right, so let's get started. This is just going to be like the head of Spider-Man altered for, um, you know, Squid Games. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw the actual head itself. So above, it's gonna you're going to have like an upside down U shape. Like so. <clears throat> gonna go down here, pull down here, like so. It's gonna be a little bit different shape, right? Because the chin's gonna be at the bottom. And I'm gonna pull down here on this side, on this side as well. And I'm gonna have like that sort of shape, okay? So it's a little bit pointier at the bottom because the chin is in there somewhere. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in the either square triangle or circle. I am going to put in the circle just because I like the way that looks. I like the triangle as well, but I'm going to put in the circle for this one, okay? So I'm going to put in curved line. You can put it in two chunks so that you don't have to draw a perfect circle or whatever or anything close to that. By the way, things can be a little different when you draw them than what I'm drawing here. That's kind of the point because you're drawing it. Um, so don't worry about it. It's, it's going to be good, okay? Curve underneath here to finish off that circle. All right. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw another circle on the inside of that. Like so. I tried to do that one in one stroke. All righty. And then comes the um, actual webbing, right, on the mask. Um, so normally you have like a webbing there and it spreads across. So I'm going to start it from uh, this point. So the middle from here, straight line down. Over here, straight line down. Not going to put it all the way through on this one. I don't want it to be like that. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here and, and imagine this line going all the way through. Imagine it, imagine it, imagine it. I'm going to see where I catch it on the other side. To do the same thing over here. Up. And I'm drawing another one up here okay cool cool we're doing good gonna do the same thing over here on this side line over here and another line right next to it like so over here same thing and another line right next to that they're a little uneven but that's fine don't worry about it it's not it's not meant to be perfect going over here like again not right drawing anything but I'm gonna find it over here and I'm gonna catch it on the other side like so, like so. Same thing over here, gonna imagine it going through, gonna catch it on this side. Going over here, going back. Now I'm gonna do it across. Over here, cross, over here. <laughs> over here on this side, I'm gonna put in another one. And over here, I'm going to put in another one on this side. Whoops. And I'm going to do another one across this way. Because what we're doing is we're drawing the webbing pattern, but a little bit different than normal. Alrighty. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to draw the curve line in like so, so the webbing. So I'm going to curve a line here. Go like this. Curve a line here. I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Curve and curve. There's going to be a thickness to it. Curve, curve, over here, curve, it's going to be pressing in like a web. I'm just kind of following it around as much as I can, okay? Also, don't forget to hit the like if you're a fan of any of these properties um, or if you like what you're doing right now. Um, I'm going to just keep doing it all the way around. So definitely hit that like button. That helps uh, the channel out, the algorithm, and it just kind of 
Um, it's just a good thing to do, honestly, as far as letting me know what else to put on this channel. Um, curve over here as well. So that's one. We're going to do another one over here. Curve. Curve. Over here, curve. Curve. Over here, curve. 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 Um, and then curve over here, then curve over here. I'm gonna keep it going. It's looking pretty pretty intense now, the design, right? And we're gonna get it going over here. I'm gonna do one more just for this because uh, it's not really gonna matter for the other ones, but I'm gonna do one more on these two, okay? The next thing, it's gonna be a little rough, okay? We are going to fill in this part right here. If you're using a marker, this is easy. You can definitely do it in, um, you can do it in pencil or anything as well. Um, and you could, or you could just leave it as is, as line art. But I'm gonna fill this in. So it kinda, you know, looks a little bit more like the show. And I'm gonna start filling in this in-between stuff. So that's gonna get kinda wild. It might get a little messy, but I'm gonna see if I can do this here by the eight minute mark. Um, and just kinda follow it around. Just It's like you're coloring your own coloring book at this point, and that's kind of awesome. I'm just filling this in. Um, like I said, I love Spider-Man. I love, um, you know, Squid Game. That was a really great show. And just trying to put some more ideas out there. If anybody has any other ideas, let me know. I heard a Squid Game Godzilla. That's kind of cool. I might do that. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. I probably will. I did like some um, Squid Game Jason Voorhees. So we'll see if I end up doing that. I probably will, knowing myself, the Squid Game Godzilla. Because I'm drawing a lot of Godzilla lately. I don't know if you've noticed that. So that would make a lot of sense to do that. So I should have left the lines a little bit thicker, but that's because when you rub up against this, the other black parts start to kind of disappear, right? So... Right on. Like so. So, and it's kind of a little bit of a marathon here. It's just like, man, this is tough, you know. Um, but it's actually really good practice, to be honest, to try to fill this in without destroying the line. Um, so that's kind of part of this. Did I? Dang, I missed the eight-minute mark. Dang it. Ah, well. So, like I said, I'm just trying to, I think I under, underestimated how long it would take me to fill this in. Um, but I don't want to speed it up. I just want to get this done. All right. It's funny because of all the Venom drawings I did and the Spider-Man uh, as Venom, let's say, uh, with, a, with a symbiote, I never filled it in. I just thought it would be too rough, but I kind of wanted to do this one because I just thought it would look you know cool to do so I just thought it would look cool to do so so um, hopefully it does look cool and hopefully it is worth it um, you know if you can't if <laughs> definitely give me a like for the effort because <laughs> I'm definitely putting a lot of effort right now 
Um, all right, almost done. Woo. Anyways, as I fill in the rest of it, thank you so much for joining. Uh, you are amazing. People are amazingly nice to me. If you found any value in this video in any way, um, please help out the channel. There's a good news. The good news about helping out the channel is it takes two seconds and is 100% free to do. Uh, go to the share button on YouTube here. There's a share button and auto share it anywhere whether it be Twitter, uh, you know, Reddit, uh, Facebook, uh, anywhere you share it, it helps the algorithm out. And what it does is it really, um, you know, kind of brings back a good flow of people that are interested. Um, I notice people that come in from shares are really cool as well. So thank you so much. I will see you in the next video. And remember to, when you start drawing, keep it easy, okay?